Do you want to know what this embroidery channel is all about? Keep watching and I'll fill you guys in. Hey everybody and welcome back. My name is Sue and I'm from OML Embroidery and today we're gonna do a little chatting. This is my vlog. What is a vlog? It's a video blog. So it's relaxed, it's a conversation, it's a chance for you guys to give me your opinion. You can see behind the scenes. There's so much we can do. Um, all embroidery related, but not necessarily doing the embroidery. More like talking about the embroidery, which is fine. So today's topic is this channel. So I'd like to explain to people what this channel is about. So first of all, a lot of people think, hey, uh, she must be making a ton of money. Uh, no, I don't make any money on the YouTube channel. That is not the point of the channel, um, but it helps. Of course, I can keep doing it longer if I make a little bit of money. That money does not come from you. It does not come from you directly. You do not have to pay me anything for the videos, for the learning videos, everything like that. You don't. I get paid by YouTube. So right now I don't get paid very much. It is not enough to even buy the equipment that I use. So that's out the window. Everyone get off that. Um, the, the second point is people are asking me what's in it for you. Okay, if it's not money, what's in it for you? Okay, I'm going to tell you guys a little story because this is a vlog, of course. Uh, two years ago, I had a heart attack and I was 48 when I had the heart attack and it caught me by surprise. I knew I was sick with something. I just didn't know what it was. So I had a heart attack and it. Uh, I've had a long road uh, to recovery. Some days when you don't see videos up, it's because I'm just not feeling up to it. And it's not because my heart is in any peril. It's because I have to take really strong meds. They make my face puffy and my, you guys probably notice my hands are always puffy. Um, it's and bruised. I bruise very easily. So those are some of the side effects of it. And I really dislike how it makes me look, but I dislike even more how it makes me feel. However, I'm still alive. So my love for Anita Good Design started many years ago. I didn't have the money and I didn't have the time because I was running my embroidery business. Um, but I always looked at, on the site or people's posts and oh, I just love the design. So of course, when you have a, I don't want to say near death experience, but I suppose it was, but a life changing experience. It, it changes how you see things and it changes your world. And fortunately, I have a wonderful husband who um, understands this. So part of my rehabilitation in a way, I guess, getting me up was embroidery. And that's when I started doing embroidery for myself. Um, by that, I mean what I want to embroider. I wanted to bright colors and stuff for my kids and stuff for my jeans and try new things and try new embroidery equipment. And I started off a couple weeks after I had the heart attack. Oh, maybe it was probably a month after I had the heart attack and Don would come up and he would hoop things for me because I didn't have the strength to hoop it and change the threads because you can't put your arms over your head when you have heart problems and put the hoop in because I couldn't do that. I pressed the button and watched it. And after, you know, two weeks, I was able to do most of the hooping myself and I was stitching all Anita Good Design designs. I went and I purchased a whole bunch of them. Any of the ones that made me happy, those are the ones that I purchased. So you can tell, you know, when I do a video on Anita Good Design and I'm enthusiastic, that's me. That is exactly how I feel about it. I love the designs. They are always gorgeous. They make me happy. 
and there's nothing I'm not affiliated with Anita Good Design. I just literally love them. So when I share them around in different groups or or anything like that or in even just in my group and and the OML embroidery page, it's for the love of Anita Good Design. I don't make any money off of it. I don't get anything free. That's the story. I've also written a blog about that. That's the story of it. So when I had the heart attack and I was getting back up on my feet, I felt really happy doing embroidery and doing what I wanted for embroidery. I love embroidery and I, I love my job. I do have a full-time job. Don and I run a business. Um, on the side, I do the videos and the, you know, the testing of things and whatnot. Um, I enjoy it and I was happy, like a different kind of happy and it was wonderful so i decided i set different life goals for myself the the first life goals were always you know have a good business you know kids all that that's always included my kids to be successful and they are they're both rns uh, one is an rn one's working on it so check um now it's time for me so different goals the goal is the youtube channel to grow that's my goal it's a hundred thousand subscribers so i can get a silly little youtube uh <laughs> play button on the wall and that would make me happy and that's it that's it so i figure it's a win-win situation so you guys are happy because you can learn about embroidery from you know, a 15 year veteran of embroidery. I don't know everything, but I sure the heck can finish, figure out most of it. I have literally millions of ideas in my head and I'm having so much fun doing it. So that's my goal. That is what I want. And what I need is for you guys to help me attain that goal. Um, just for the love of embroidery, just to make people happy doing embroidery. I can't do any of it without you. Um, and hopefully you find value in my videos and my ideas and, and help in the group and help on the YouTube channel. I listen to what people are asking and I make a video about it. Hopefully that'll answer your questions and make even just one person you know, less frustrated or happy or feel accomplished or anything like that. That's my goal. That's honestly what it is. So a hundred thousand subscribers and a whole bunch of views. And that's what I set out to do. And that's what I'd like to accomplish. So how can you help me do this? More people to watch, um, watching the whole video that counts and sharing. Uh, and of course, liking and commenting and uh, don't hijack anything. <laughs> liking and comment, all those things are going to make the channel successful and I can reach this goal that I have. And it's uh, just a life goal. It's just something that'll make me really happy and successful. So do you guys think you can help me do it? That's all a win-win situation. You get videos that help you out and I get 100,000 subscribers and a silly YouTube thing on the wall. So there we go. I will continue in the meantime. I will continue making videos that will help you guys out. Will show you new tools. You don't have to. I'm not selling anything. I'm showing you guys new tools, new embroidery techniques. I need a good design as much as possible. Fun little tips and tricks. And of course, my vlog. We gotta love that. So, um, help out if you can. It does not cost you guys anything. It's a minute or two of your time. If you imagine we have almost 18,000. Uh, people subscribed to the channel. Can you imagine if everybody or even half shared one video, how huge that would be? Um, one person shared into another group and it got me 10,000 views in a day. 
And if everyone did that, can you imagine? It wouldn't take me long to get there and I'd be super happy. So that's my goal. I, I hope you guys can help me get to that goal and we can all celebrate together and keep learning more and more about embroidery and advancing your skills and simply being happy. That's what we need to do. Be confident in every stitch. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you guys like my vlog. I hope you guys understand what this channel is about and why I spend so much time creating valuable videos that, you know, with cameras and with good microphones and green screen because I love that um, for you guys to make it better and better and hopefully you guys can do the same thing for me. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!